If, if we start with the children, uh, there's, there's now a, a recognized disorder called nature deficit disorder, which is affecting most of the children in North America. They, they no longer play in the outdoors. They never... There's a lot of reasons why, mainly because the sort of perceptions of danger and children need to be protected, but it means that they don't get to go and play freely, they don't get to experience nature directly. So I, I think that's one of the most important things uh, in this urban environment we live in is preserving pieces of nature that they can go and experience. I think that's one problem. A lot of people are kind of nervous uh, going into the woods. Um, there's really not much there that's going to hurt them except perhaps the mosquitoes, <laughs> which uh, this time of year can be a problem. But most of the year um, the, it's a wonderful place to be and we, we've taken children out there um, and, and it's a, they're, they're always surprised if they haven't been there before they, they just didn't know there's a whole world there that they didn't know existed so we really have to do more to, 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 to get them out there and show them what's there One time I took some, some children in there and they sat down on a, on a branch and turn their hands like that. So, hey, what are you doing? Oh, we're watching TV. <laughs> I was so shocked. <laughs> I said, well, you can just look around here. I try to express, look up and they, oh yes, I can see that. And, and they, get, they do get excited when you show them, but if you just take them like that, no, no. Well, are we there yet? What's this, you know, there's mosquitoes. So you have to show them things that are interesting.